Well, it's Sunday morning. I was up at six and I took the dog for a walk on the beach before just the sun was rising. A pretty nice sunrise, gotta say. Good work, good work. I've been here about a month now and um, you know I'm waiting for, <laughs> waiting for the notary to give us an appointment and we got that Friday afternoon around 5 30 got the call we have an appointment not this Monday but next Monday to finalize this um, purchase I'm making down here however um, we had agreed which was odd to me that I could write a check as long as the check had my uh, address um, no my name and um, account number on it I thought that was strange because I had offered to wire the money which I'd done before with the seller when I sent his deposit to him directly. Um, but, uh, they said, yeah, but, but this time they said they wanted a certified check and I want a certified check. That means I have to drive to the United States and let me say something here about this. <laughs> I'm only 100 miles from the United States and a lot of people who live down here uh, who are retirement age have Medicare and they will go to the United States for medical care. I didn't love the medical care in the United States when I lived there, and there's no way I would be driving there. I have all my care here before I've talked about this, and I'm perfectly happy, and so far it's been just fine. But the problem with going to the United States, for those of you who are worried about the border, is it can take you from one hour to six hours, sometimes longer, to get across from Mexico to the USA because the United States government stops every single car, every single car and person who goes through there to see your paperwork. And although they have 25 booths, very rare that more than 10 of them are open and 45,000 cars go through that, uh, the San Ysidro, San Diego um, entrance to the United States every single morning. People line up at five o'clock in the morning to be able to get there to go to school or to go to work. <clears throat> Mexico, on the other hand, <laughs> You can drive through and wave. You just wave. That doesn't mean they're not looking. Cameras are taking a picture of your face and cameras are catching your license plate. Okay, so it looks very casual as you come through, unless you come through with a truck and dark windows, they're gonna stop you. Um, so it's just murder to get out, aside from the fact that it's actually three hours to go there and 100 miles out, and then whatever I have to do, go to the bank and get in line, blah, 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 hope they'll, that they'll approve what I want and get out. And it turns out that neither bank does certified. I, uh, Wells Fargo and um, Schwab, or Schwab, <laughs> Schwab's not. Schwab's a great bank, by the way, especially if you travel. But they don't have, they don't have um, branches. Uh, they're, they're an investment brokerage firm. So they don't issue cashier's checks and that sort of stuff. So, uh, <laughs> my friend said, I said, oh, well, no, no, we'll just drive up there. Well, she, she's 39. <laughs> idea of a good uh, today is let's drive to San, San Diego. Also, she just came back a month ago from there and she had COVID. They are like, COVID is rampant in the United States right now. We're uh, just a little bit here. I always wear a mask down here when I go inside to anything. They're going to see me in a mask when I go to that notario's office, an N95, because I ain't fooling around. So um, after I calm down, <laughs> this is me calm now. <laughs> I wrote um, back to uh, the um, immobiliere, you know, the um, real estate advisor who was handling all the paperwork and said, you know, please, please ask the notary that I can bring my um, laptop with me and I can wire the money directly from there or write a check. But if I had a choice, and I do, <laughs> wire the money. So that's my Sunday morning. Oh, and I saw the cutest little thing of people fishing and a dog that tries to steal their fish on the beach. So that's on under shorts if you get a chance to take a look at it.